Space Marines Heavy Intercessors. My pre-order is here, and I'm gonna unbox it so you can see what's in the box. What's in the box? What's in the box? So I called up my local Games Workshop store and uh, got the pre-order on the day of the pre-order for the Space Marines Heavy Intercessors. Um, and I was kind of excited for it. Uh, I'm not a huge uh, Intercessors uh, Primaris Marines fan, but this was keeping me back from building some of my other squads for my Death Watch army. So now that it's here, and no, I refuse to buy the Kill Team thing just for these five models. Uh, I waited for this, hoping it was a multi-part kit. Uh, and I think that's what's in here, so we'll take a look. But, <laughs> I also picked up this guy. Uh, he's the Space Marines Captain in Gravis armor. Um, so <laughs> he's been available for a while, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but when I called the guy at the local games workshop store, he said, hey, do you also want this thing? And whenever I'm calling or ordering something from Games Workshop, my default answer is yes. So, maybe I'm a sucker, maybe he's an upselling genius. Whatever the case, I have an extra model. This is like my, I don't know, 12th Space Marine Captain. Uh, whatever, he looks cool, I'll paint him. But the focus of this video is gonna be these guys. Let's take a look. got one two sprues we've got some big old bases oh these are not the 32 millimeter I think these are 40 millimeter uh, let's see and we've got the usual transfer sheets and it looks like a full color oh uh, yeah well not full full color but colorful uh, instruction guide neat Oh, you know what? Let me see what the size of the bases are. If it says. Yeah. They're 40 millimeter bases, kind of like your hero units. All right, so let's take a look at this one first and see what's in the box. All right, we'll start here. Shoulder pads. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten shoulder pads. Uh, you know, uh, ten arms on these five dudes. We've got a couple of heads. These are some mean looking heads, look at that. Uh, yeah, they're pretty aggressive looking, I like that. Uh, here we have the boots, the sabaton, I think it's what they're called in French. Uh, a couple of these little bullet, um, I don't know, call them charms maybe. Another <coughs> one of these legs. My dog's dying over here. Uh, we've got uh, one arm. He's got the. <laughs> this one's molded uh, with the two finger point, which is much uh, much scarier than just the finger guns, right? Uh, yeah. We have here. It looks like looks like a, a Vox caster or a, an Auspex of some sort. Here we have the front and the back of a Space Marine. And we have another arm. Uh, an arm with uh, no hand. What are these? Oh, these, these are probably the little tidbit that go on the, space, on the weapons uh, to make them like the assault bolter or whatever. There's two variants I think you can build, and so this is the part that uh, denotes that that is this special version of the weapon. Here we've got some pistols in holster um, and from from seeing bolter pistols before that holster looks really really tiny shenanigans I call shenanigans on that one but uh, here we have a bolter of some sort one of the variants I'm again I'm not 
as versed with Primaris Marines. I don't really know what the differences are. Uh, but it's nice and chonky. It's it's not a pistol. It's like a rifle-looking thing. And it's got this magazine here at the bottom. Uh, or like it looks like a drum mag, but who knows. Uh, here we have some more arms. Oh, this is, looks like a weapon component. We have a cluster of uh, purity seals. We have this little icon here. Um, we have uh, two power plants. We have another purity seal, just the one. Uh, another torso and back. Oh, torso. Oh, two torsos, a couple of arms, some more legs. Another torso, another head. Uh, here we have another line of heads. Oh, we have this uh, equipment pouch right there. So that's sprue number one. Sprue number two. Oh. Yeah, it's a little different. I mean, we have this, a lot of the same components. Like we have uh, some torsos, some legs, and some arms. What's different here is we have uh, kind of this line of bolter rifles. Uh, and we have some some more holsters here, but you'll notice this holster is a little different from the last one. This one has some uh, gribblies on it. Looks like uh, there are two rounds, two two rounds of ammunition on the holster. Um, we have uh, <laughs> the dreaded tubes. Uh, space Mar primary space marines are littered with these tubes that connect one part, like an arm or a weapon, to the body. And this is one of the reasons I avoid Primaris Marines. It looks really cool, but holy cow, it is tedious to get that stuff on there and to look right. Um, gross. Uh, another equipment pouch. Here we have a few uh, pistols in holster without the gribblies. Uh, let's see. Oh, we have some, looks like some unmasked, I don't know why I get have dog hair everywhere, some uh, unmasked heads for Space Marines. Uh, oh, we have another equipment deal here, but this one has combat knives on it. And so here's this Bolter variant. I'm not quite sure what this is. I haven't looked at the instructions or even the codex to see, but it, it is clearly a different weapon. You'll see how it has this tube. This is the guy I'll have, I'll have to fight with when I put this kit together whenever I get around to it. So that's it. Space Marines, heavy intercessors. Looks like a cool kit. When I build it and paint it, I will let you know. Have a nice one, everybody. Be nice to yourselves and each other. Space Marines Heavy Interceptors. My pre- <laughs>